I've got that scouting spirit up in my head, up in my head, up in my head. I've got that scouting spirit up in my head, up in my head to stay. Hi, I'm Desmond Duque. So nice to meet you, man. I'm Felix's dad. Well, nice to meet you, Desmond. Welcome to Camp Kickapoo. Oh, goodness. Fresh, clean air, man. Yeah, it's beautiful, isn't it? Finally, out of the concrete jungle. I declare this a no-stress, pressure-free zone. Back to just man as he should be, one-on-one -on -one with nature. Yeah, it's the kind of place you could just take off your clothes and run naked into the woods and never look back. Exactly. In fact, I refuse to wear shoes. They're coming off for the duration. Well, are you sure? There, there could be sharp things all over the place here. Doesn't matter. Coming off. The, the strength, the force of this earth can feed my feet and work its way up to my soul, as they say. <laughs> okay, well, that, that's great, Desmond. Okay, so why don't you just head up the trail this way, that's where the campsite is, um, and you'll see where the tents are located, okay? Looks like Felix found the other kids, so we'll just let them play for a while. Sounds good, mates. <clears throat> see you on the other side, eh? <laughs> <laughs> see? Getting out like this can have a huge impact on people. Yeah, there might be more to this scouting stuff than I realized. It's gonna be a great weekend. Mm -hmm. You the welcome wagon girls? <laughs> hey, Michael. Yes, the uh, welcoming committee we are. Welcome. Jesus, this place is beautiful. Yeah, it's the kind of place you could just take off your clothes and run naked in the woods and never look back. What the fuck does that mean? Um, kind of... No, Mike, Michael, this is my friend Eddie, and he's, he's very excited to be here. If you're going to run around naked, let's not be too excited, okay there, Tarzan? Lilliputian cocks tend to freak me out, right? Stay away from me. Lilliputian cock? <laughs> Come on, I'm kidding, all right? But seriously, not too close. We up this way? Hmm? What a motherfucking asshole. What? I'm not even a stay-at-home. I work. Why does he talk to me like that? Yes, when you're not nearly as deserving of such abuse as I am. That's not what I meant. Look, don't tell people you want to run off into the woods naked until you know them a little better. Desmond got it, so I thought... I know, I know. You thought it'd be your fun little greeting thing. Yeah, like a conversation piece, right, you know? It's, it's not going to work on everybody, so I, I wouldn't say it. Okay, what if I don't say naked? I just say, it's so beautiful, I just want to run into the woods and not look back, but without the naked. Yeah, sure. Say that. Come on. Or I could say. Hey, are you Nate? Yeah, hi. Oh, hi, I'm Sonia Orson's mom. Oh, hi, nice to meet you. Wow, look at you, tents already up, fresh coffee, way to go. Yeah, well, I know it's a dad's kind of weekend, but Orson really wanted to come. And my brother, he's in rehab, he's a fucking asshole, he couldn't bring him. Yeah, totally fine. This is a parent-child camp, moms and dads. Oh, thank you, that means a lot. Oh, hey, I brought a little something special for later. We'll just keep it on the DL for now. Okay. Not tonight. It's just it's just something that I used to do with Orson's dad when we went camping. <laughs> Great. <laughs> oh yeah. Hey, do you need help with your tent? No. But uh <laughs> but I think he might. Oh my god. God damn it! <sighs> Quit your crying, you fucking pussy. <laughs> Fuck! Oh, sorry, everyone. Stepped on a thorn here. All's well. Hey, Desmond, why don't you put your shoes back on until you get a better feel for the place? Oh, nope. I want the place to get a feel for me. Uh, I'm getting in touch with something primal, and I don't want to jeopardize whatever breakthrough I'm on the verge of having. Okay. Holy shit, that porta potty is is filthy. The floor is a standing pool of urine. You know, piss. Yeah, yeah, I, I know what urine is. Yeah, I tried to throw clumps of toilet paper down and make like a walkway, yeah. and they got soaked as soon as I stepped in. Oh, them. yeah. Oh, no, oh, he God. is not. Oh, Desmond. Oh, no. Desmond, De dude, no. Uh, ugh. Okay, ugh. Okay. Uh, hey, Nate. Where's the little bitches? Oh, I'm sorry. I mean the kids. Well, they're uh, playing at the moment, Patrick. Is that allowed? Well, sure, but shouldn't they be warming up? 
For what? The race for the Thunderstick. It's about 15 minutes, and then we have a whole afternoon of Olympic-style events. Well, they're ready. It's just sports and games, right? Oh, my God. It's like taking candy from a crippled kid. Have you even looked at the handbook yet? No, I was going to do it during the games. Um, hi. Hello. If you've read Chapter 12, Sections 1 through 8.3, of your beaver leader handbook, you'd actually see that most beaver colonies have been preparing for several months now, leading up to the campery. Well, we've only been a beaver colony for a little over a week, so um, <laughs> I wish this had been covered at the leader meeting last weekend. It actually was. Unfortunately, you uh, left early at uh, that point. Oh. Huh. Okay, well... You know, look, I guess my guys will just have to have fun, not worry so much about winning, which is, it's really the point, anyway, right? Wow. Well, the flag ceremony is in 10 minutes, so we'll see you down there, she pushed in. Oh, I'm sorry, Nate. But you know, I think I just gave you your new tribal name. He big shit pushed in. Villa. Um, <clears throat> well, I, I guess they, uh, they take things a little more serious than I anticipated. Um, you know, look, I, I'm, I'm all about the kids. Just playing, having fun. I, I don't want them to get caught up in a bunch of competitive stuff. Just, just fun. Yeah? Bring it in, guys. Yeah? All right. Well, let's go get our little guys. Let's, let's have a blast today, okay? And... Yeah! yeah! Please stop crying. <laughs> You didn't have fun today, um, so the losing didn't feel good, and we got to change that, and we will, okay? So, tell a ghost story and get some sleep. Please stop crying. Our boys will shine tonight, our boys will shine. Our boys will shine tonight, hold down the line. They're all dressed up tonight. Oh,